Hey, I'm Chef Willy C. Nide, running for the president of Argentina, America. The A U S A. I'll go to park the car. The main goal of this campaign is to replace the man that's currently presiding as president. That man's name is Martin Luther King Jr. Wait, his name's Obama? Barack Obama, we gotta get him out of there. Send the army on the front lawn of the White House. Missile strike. He's gonna run away. He's gonna run away. That's when I come in, take over the White House. Is it hot in here? Is it just my beaver? Important thing to consider is that we're all here now. This is not time travel. Foreign policy. Let's talk about it for one second. Why is it foreign? Let's keep those jobs in America. Let's play baseball on our own court before we go off giving Mexico $300 for their new soccer park. <sighs> Who likes Chinese food? The thing about Medicare is we gotta slash it. Prices. Now introducing the person who some might say is my running mate. He's got similar policy ideas as me, but he challenges me at the same time. That's the way a good relationship works, in the bedroom and out. Not that we're in the bed together, only on sleepovers. Welcome. He's the man with the plan that I told him to say. Dean Pickles. I like your left side better. Yeah, come on I like over. It over. I like it. It's more comfortable. How's the family? I know oh. you got your wife. <laughs> the, the ring of Mordor. Where'd you go? Uh, he's down. Three months since I've seen them all. Uh, ah! it's okay. She'll come back to you. My wife got a restraining order. That's what she wants. She wants me, she's ordered me to restrain her. Congratulations. And, uh, kids, uh, the, uh, my youngest son, Tracy. Youngest son, Tracy. He's three months old. He's got eyes like mine. Yeah, just, and I love him. Uh. Hey. The topic of discussion is healthcare. Do you care for healthy people? Are the people who don't need the doctor's appointments, do they get them? Get it out of here. What do you think? How long have Now let's you? talk about the military. I hear recently they're cutting the budget. Now how are we going to make the American people believe that I'm a male? You, you show them. What you do is you say, hey troops. Hey troops. And you hit a home run. They, they walk out like this. They give you the respect you deserve. Okay, have you ever taken a dog to a public park and they told you, hey, your dog can't poop on this lawn, I made it. I'm taking that law back. We're shipping it to Africa. Which we're tying to a dragon. Can we use that dragon on the commercial? Taxes. I'm against them. But am I for them? Yes. If you don't want taxes, go live by the beach. Beaches are now tax-free. Congratulations. If you're on the beach, can I please have some sushi? Now, unemployment. There's 7 million unemployed Americans right now. That's about 12%. Let's get that up to 100%. I'm talking about bringing in the Puerto Ricans, bringing in the Mexicans, bringing in the Filipinos. Let's put them to work. America's done working. We had 200 good years. We're done. So, uh, when you bring them in, you, they, do our, they do our jobs. They do our jobs for us. I sit in my room. Uh, uh, we're done working, everybody. Go home. As vice president, I'll make sure friendship, number one concern, best friends. We don't have many of those anymore. Let's get them back. Uh, everyone should be uh, shaking ha oh, my ring. Nelson Mandela had the best handshake in the world, and he's been president of South America for 28 years. Stay, stay on. <sighs> Ooh, good. Oof. Now we're ready to talk about sports. Kick it! Uh, touchdown Packers. Touchdown America. As Commander in Ocean, you would have complete control of the whales. I take them, taming the whales. Let's make them our allies. They've got all the power, they control the fish. If you control the fish, you control the Japanese financial markets. Where Now where'd you put the whales? Can I have some whales, please? I want control of I'm, the universe. Uh, Canoeing through the ocean. You know, you know what one's hard is the D. Which one? It, you got Taking love to a whale in the ocean. How do you feel about Whitney Houston? Uh, we gotta put her on the buses. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
chili bean dip. Let's put the homeless people on the moon. Homeless? A homeless colony? Just put them in. Just put them in. Put them in a spaceship, fly them to the moon. Who pays for the spaceship? Afghanistan. Once the homeless people get to the moon, they're gonna make houses out of the moon cheese. Step two, whales on the moon. Space, space whale. Space whale. Space whale. Uh -huh. If you put a whale on the moon, he will find the moon fish. If you're homeless and you're on the moon, you've already won the battle. The enemy, the new terrorist, sinkholes. We got Fill them up, put in some cement. Uh, ah! Nightmare. This is our new sign. New sign. This isn't right. What how do you what do you think? Uh, That's not my name. Yes, possibly. Now this looks right to me. Dan? Dan? Do we have a Dan? Uh, we're I'm making at, sure. I'm at 13. How many are there? Wait, did you count? I gotta restart. I gotta restart. Did you I count got, the I got, triangles? I gotta restart. Oh, is there some on the back too? There's a hidden message back here. Thanks for listening, America. Ha! 2012. Uh, January 13th. We're gonna beat the polls. We're gonna beat the place. You know who to vote for now. That mess this message has been brought to you by the campaign for Willie C. and Day and Dean Pickles for the President and Vice President of the United States of America. Don't forget to vote. Let's put the homeless people on the moon.